Today, we talk about Colonel Sanders. How's it going, everybody? Hey, let me ask you, how many of you out there remember NBC's Little House on the Prairie? Somebody has to know it, right? Well, if you remember Little House on the Prairie, then hopefully, and maybe you don't, but hopefully you remember the episode Wave of the Future. It's the Wave of the Future. That's the episode where Harriet signs a contract, uh, well, she's tricked into signing a contract, with a restaurant that only serves three meals a day. Mrs. Sullivan's Kitchen. Now, that doesn't sound too bad, does it? But it was the 1880s. All that to say, the whole thing just backfires. It's funny, but a little unrealistic. No, 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 it's, it's nothing like a robot apocalypse or dinosaurs coming back to life. Um, after the whole deal that Harriet has with the restaurant is called off, you know what, I I'll just play you the clip. You in charge here? Yes, my husband and I are. I wondered if I could interest you it's in Colonel a business Sanders. proposition. A business proposition? I'm opening a number of restaurants which will devote themselves to just one meal. The most succulent, delicious, appetizing fried chicken that ever passed your lips. One meal? Just fried chicken? Something Obviously, she thinks this is such a ridiculous <laughs> no, idea. I'm sorry, uh, but you see, wait, you we can see how hindsight the really is by just serving three meals. So I can't quite see somebody coming to a restaurant for only one meal, <laughs> fried chicken. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I'm sorry you're not interested. Frankly, I think it's the wave of the future. <laughs> well, I'm terribly hey, sorry. Hey, that's the name of the episode. I think you're wasting your time. <laughs> Time will tell. Time will tell. Time will tell, won't it? Who was that man? Oh, some silly old man with an idea about having a restaurant that only serves one meal. Fried chicken. <laughs> That's all? That's all. <laughs> hey, how about having a piece of lemon meringue pie? Ooh. <laughs> Fried chicken. <laughs> Fried chicken. Who would have thunk it? I know what you're thinking. Who would resist an offer from Colonel Sanders? Well, obviously, it may be a little unrealistic, but it's also, you know, I mean, she didn't know. Hindsight really is 2020. But this is unrealistic. Some might say it's a bit anachronistic because Colonel Sanders actually wasn't born yet until 19. Colonel Sanders wasn't even born. Colonel Sanders. Colonel Sanders wasn't even born until. 1989. Oh, Colonel Sanders wasn't even born until 1890. Which means that, um, well, this wouldn't have happened in the 1880s. Come on. And Kentucky Fried Chicken didn't start until 1952. Get the idea now? 
Well, I think it's a pretty funny scene, even if it is a bit anachronistic, like I said. Well, thanks so much for watching this episode. Thank you to uh, Noah for asking me to come and be on the show. If you like this video, then check out some of the other videos on this channel. And, you know, if you uh, like what I had to say, or you, you just like my face, then be sure to check out my channel. It's Say Goodnight Kevin, youtube.com slash Say Goodnight Kevin. The link is in the description. All right, that's all I've got to say, and I'll talk to you all later. Good night.